In this video, we're going to be going over how to create a smart NPC from complete scratch which uses ChatGPT to answer and respond to the questions that you ask it. Hello, who are you? Hello, I am Kenji, a ninja from a long line of renowned warriors. I have trained in the art of stealth, combat, and precision since I was a young boy. What can I do for you? Can you tell me more about yourself? Sure, my father. Kojiro was a highly respected ninja in our clan. Under his guidance, I have honed my skills and become an expert in ninjutsu. To get started, you're going to want to head over to convai.com. Go to this website and sign up and create an account. Here is where we're going to design how our AI should behave. Once you've created an account, we just want to go to the dashboard and go create new character. So here's where we're going to design our new AI character. Let's give our character a name. So I'm just going to call my character Jimmy. Then we can decide how we want our character to sound. So I'm just going to give them a young US masculine voice. And then here is where we write the backstory for our character. So your AI is going to use this information. So for example, I could write the backstory of my character. Maybe he used to be a ninja. So you can write the backstory manually, or if you want to save time, we can use another AI like ChatGPT and I'm just going to give it the prompt to write the backstory for my video game character. He used to be a ninja, but now he is retired. So ChatGPT wrote me a cool backstory for my ninja character. Um, it gave him a name of Kenji, so I'm just going to copy this and actually just paste it here. And I'm going to change my character's name from Jimmy to Kenji because I prefer this name and I can just click create character and once this finishes loading it will um, load up and create my character if you want to you can change the avatar but I'm not really too concerned with it okay once you've done that head over to the Unreal Engine marketplace and go to search for products and look for Conv AI. they have a marketplace plugin we just want to download and install this to the version of Unreal Engine that you're using so just click install to engine and then I've currently installed this to Unreal Engine version 5.1 because that's the version I'm using. But make sure to just install it to the version of Unreal Engine that you're currently using. Next, you want to open up your Unreal Engine project where you want to have your smart NPC. And we just want to enable the Conv AI plugin. So go over to Edit, then Plugins, then search for Conv AI. Just check it and then it will ask you to restart the editor. Just click it so it restarts with the plugin. And then in order to make it so we can have voice chat and actually speak to the AI with our microphone, we need to do one thing. So if we just go over to the content drawer, right click, and we just want to go to show and explore, then go to whatever your project is called. So my project's called Smart NPC. We want to go to the config folder and open up the default engine any and we just want to go to the top and paste these two lines. I will leave a link in the description of where you can just copy these lines and paste them. And this will just allow it so we can speak to our AI. We can close this and then just restart your project. So it restarts with um, the settings enabled. So I'll just do that now. Okay, once you've done that, we want to go over to your player character inside of your game project. So I'm in the first person template, so I'm just going to open up the first person character. And we just want to go to class settings and change the parent class to be the conv AI base player. So this one, we can just save this, then close this. Then the next thing we're going to do is set up our AI. So we're going to use a meta human to quickly add a meta human to your project. We can just go here where it says quickly add things to the project and go to Quixel Bridge. From here, we just want to go to MetaHumans. Then once this loads, just find a MetaHuman that you want to use. So I'm just going to use this guy and I'm just going to add him to my project. When you're adding the MetaHuman, just make sure to enable all these missing plugins. Otherwise, it won't work. So I'm just going to enable this, this, this. And then you're probably going to need to restart your editor again. So it kind of just restarts with the plugins enabled. So I'm just going to do that. Okay, so if you just go to the MetaHuman folder and find the character that you downloaded, open them up, 
And I found that there are some like warning signs that I get. So if we just go to one of them, it says get scheduled match has been depreciated. Please use get scheduled match asset. So just drag off here and look for get skeletal mesh asset and connect this into here and here and we can just delete this then if we go to the second one we'll do the same thing here drag off here and we'll get skeletal mesh asset and connect this into here and this will remove the um, warning messages then you just want to go to class settings and for parent class change this to be the conv ai and we want the conv ai base character then if we go to the viewport just select your meta human's face and then for the animation class we just want this to be the conv ai meta human face and then just select the body and then for the animation class if you just look for body and select the conv ai meta human body and then we just want to compile this close this and then if you go over to edit go to project settings and we just want to scroll down and look for plugins find conf ai it's going to ask us for our api key this is what allows it to connect to your online account to get the api key open up the conf ai and then just click this key icon and just copy it and just paste it in here then close that and then I'm going to go to my content drawer drag in a manual and you're going to see it has this character ID if we go back to our comp AI online we can just copy our characters ID and just paste it here then if I just go play and I hold the T button and talk to him, I can speak with this AI. So I'm just going to ask him what his name is. Hello, what's your name? My, My name, name is, is Kenji. Kenji. It's, a, it's pleasure a pleasure to meet, to meet you. you. Nice to meet you as well. Can you tell me more about yourself? Can you tell me more about yourself? Sure. sure. I, come I come from a, from a long, long line of revered ninjas. ninjas. I was, I was trained, trained from an early age in the art of stealth, combat, combat and precision. And precision. I'm, I'm highly skilled, skilled in these areas, areas and take great pride in my abilities. abilities. And with this, we have made a smart AI. So I'm just using the free version of this product. There is a paid version where you can get access to more features. But I think this is a pretty cool technology. So that's all for this video. I hope you learned something. If you enjoyed, like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.